We have seen a strong run up fueled largely by optimism over the new government. However, it looks like it may take longer for the CapEx cycle to kick in for two of India's largest infrastructure companies, GVR, GVK and GMR, who have both said that they will uh, wait for ground realities to really improve before they go forward. Uh, Amrita, you've been uh, tracking that story. Uh, what's the latest? Uh, Clearly, both power and infrastructure companies seem to be focusing on its await and watch mode. Uh, CapEx cycle is, go is going to take a longer time to start with GVK and power, GVK power and infrastructure. The CapEx for this year is uh, focused completely on uh, completing existing projects. They haven't firmed up any fresh uh, CapEx plans for new investments. Uh, uh, they have a QIP plan. In fact, they have a board approval to raise around 300 to 400 crore rupees via uh, the QIP route. This is mainly to uh, uh, complete those projects which are still under construction. So CapEx remains focused there on fresh inv investments. What the company has to say is they're not looking at any new projects at the moment uh, until and unless the ground realities improve. Uh, that would refer to your clearances coming in, to your investment sentiments uh, to improving on the power side, uh, more clarity on the fuel supply side. So as far as GVK power and infrastructure is to be spoken about, uh, new projects are not coming in unless and until we see not just sentimental improvement, but also ground realities improvement. Moving to GMR infrastructure, another major in the infrastructure space. Uh, they have a capex plan for this year of around 2000 crore rupees this is lower against uh, 3900 crore rupees of capex uh, spent in the uh, fy14 year uh, this again is for under construction projects the company categorically says the focus remains on completing projects as well as improving profitability of the existing projects they say there's no big investment plan currently gmr in fact has ipo plans for the energy business mm. as well as aviation business uh, on that commenting on that they say uh, while the new government seems to be focused on uh, infrastructure seems to be a key area for the new uh, government and they uh, seem positive. They acknowledge the fact that we could see reforms in the sector. They're not giving a timeline for those IPOs, both on the energy and aviation side. All they have to say is uh, we will go about with these uh, IPOs, both for the energy and airport business at an appropriate time. So clearly, both these majors on a wait and watch more as well as investments are to be spoken about.